what's going on everybody frank valkyria welcome to the channel are you listening uh actually i meant can you hear me that's a better question eh? because we're still set up here in italy after a few days of arriving still trying to find out but what we find out here today is that andy signore from popcorn planet has the full video of those clips that we checked last time of the elevator of this Cara de la Vigne or de la Vigne or de la Vigne however you prefer with certain other person doing things that uh, yeah if it wasn't because of the circumstances totally kind of normal but also not so let's check this out I hope I can show this this is an exclusive for Popcorn Planet so go subscribe there but uh, just want to show it to you as well let's go let's see what happens yes it's like all right there it is all right and there it was and there it continues and it continues so that's um sorry i don't want to show of course you know the whole video of andy but you have the full thing i i don't remember now actually if they were like um going down or going up actually looks like they're going down and uh of course we, we've seen this clip this part of the kiss this looks like the way down though and i was watching before the video of andy he said that there is no timestamp, so it's also going to be difficult to really find out um where this thing came from i was just trying to understand if there was more to it then just they were together and it's very clear they don't care about getting caught and no matter when this happened if she's still in the ecb boat building she's either with johnny and, and keep in mind he's paying for this through the whole time he's always paying for it he's she's either with johnny or i guess if my source is wrong she's doing it right after all the trauma everything it, it makes no sense this is a weird way to cope. Uh, I would agree with uh, I would agree with Andy Senor 100%. That's a very peculiar way of coping with the whatever happened with uh, with JD. To me, honestly, it seems like two people which they're very familiar, extremely familiar. You know, familiar to the point where you know that there has been already a long uh, interaction that has also given way to. Um, acting spontaneous and sensual in that manner you know this is not just something like oh okay we're gonna start something no obviously what i'm trying to say is that they've done this for quite some time and it's obvious that she had some type of relationship with uh with the model so this is the same building like andy was saying doesn't matter you know if it was just before the divorce or you know or, or after because this is a sign that those two people had something going on for quite some time honestly so you you can see it clearly um and also how she was happy to take the initiative um age so definitely it's amusing of course in other circumstances i wouldn't give a damn about this honestly the only reason why we give a damn right now it's because it's the blatant lies we, which we were subjected for like six weeks trying to tell us a different story and actually like a good uh, ending fable those things are popping out showing really who is the villain in this whole thing and it seems pretty clear that uh, it was never JD was never it was never too much of a problem perhaps he had other type of issues but not this one, the one of probably going behind this back, not only with all that he provided for these people, and also her friends to live in the Columbia building, but also in terms of relationship. And I guess, you know, like some of the videos were and audios where he was acting jealous. Um, again, it's because, you know, once you know that your partner is so prone to this type of behavior, whether by telling you or not then you start to get suspicious and it makes you feel insecure and insecure is not a great base for uh, having a communication a contact with the person so definitely i can also understand why uh, he might have expressed a little bit of jealousy uh, jd towards her 
uh, to me it makes perfect sense, especially if he was she was this manipulative doing things behind its back. So again, um, I'm really waiting for more stuff to come out. I was waiting for Andrea to release some paper. I don't know, probably it's going to take some time again. Uh, please, guy, let me know if you know it before I do, because I don't have any internet connection everywhere. So, and also I've said, if you want to see some Italian blogs, I'm working on the setup. Let me know if you would enjoy that. We'll get to it daily if you want, because you make this happen. All right, guys, talk to you later. Always spread love. Ciao. Thank you so much, Andy Signor. I hope you don't mind sharing this with also my audience. Go subscribe to Andy if you're not. And ciao. Wow. Soon. Thank you. Mm -hmm.